In this video, I'm going to cover how I make my videos and the tools I use, both hardware and software. I get a lot of questions about this, so I wanted to get this information out there. Whether you're looking to create an educational channel like mine, or maybe produce some other type of content and are just curious about the tools I use. So whatever it is, I hope you find this information to be helpful. So let's get into the first thing here, and it says main device. And for my main device, I use a laptop. So I record my videos, I edit my thumbnails, my backgrounds, everything is based off of this laptop. Now number two, audio. Now my laptop doesn't pick up the best audio as far as quality, so I need an external mic. So I would suggest if you're looking to create content, see how your mic is and if it picks up quality audio. If not, an external mic is always an option. I dropped the link to the external mic I use down in the description. Now next we have backgrounds and thumbnails. Now for my backgrounds and thumbnails, I use Adobe Photoshop. Adobe Photoshop is a very expansive program. It can be overwhelming at first, but once you get the hang of it and you start to learn how to do things within the program, you can really see how powerful and helpful um, the program is as far as creating quality content. Um, I highly suggest Adobe Photoshop and any of the, any of the Adobe uh, programs for that matter. Now number four is probably the question I get the most, so creating the content. How do I get the writing on the screen? So I use a graphic tablet to get the writing on, this, on the screen. And specifically, I use a Wacom Intuos graphic tablet. That's the brand. And it's a little rectangle, black rectangle with white trim, and it comes with a stylus. So whatever I write, on that tablet, it shows up on my screen. So it's very easy to pick up and get down. It just takes a little bit of practice to see how your writing translates to the screen. But like I said, it's pretty easy to pick up. I've been very happy with it. So again, something else I highly recommend. And I dropped the link to the specific graphic tablet that I use down in the description if you wanna go check it out. Now number five, how to record. So how am I recording my voice and the screen? So I use a program called OBS Studio. And this is the best program I've come across as far as recording, and it's all free. So you can just Google OBS Studio, download, install, and you're good to go. So OBS Studio, highly recommend, and best of all, it's free. And then lastly, number six, so how do I edit the videos? Well, actually, I outsource my editing. I'm learning now with my other channel. I have a science channel I just started up, and I wanted to learn how to edit the videos, so I'm starting to learn. But uh, my editor uses Adobe Premiere. Sorry, I was thinking about the spelling there for some reason for a second. So Adobe Premiere, which is a, obviously a part of the Adobe programs there. And just like Photoshop, it can be overwhelming at first, but there's a little learning curve. Once you get it down, you can see the quality of the program. So again, I suggest Adobe Premiere and any Adobe programs. So those are the tools I use and how I make my videos with those tools. I hope that answered some of your questions. If you have any follow-up questions, feel free to email me or drop a comment. I try to answer as many emails and comments as possible. Um, so reach out and I'll try to get back to you. Uh, thanks so much for watching. I hope that helped. Until next time, peace.